green spaces in and around cities look great and provide recreational or contemplative space for residents. But did you know that green spaces like this can naturally treat stormwater pollution, resulting in cleaner streams and groundwater? I'm Jim Eakins, University of Idaho Extension Water Educator. In this episode, let's take a closer look at one green space that limits stormwater flowing from Spokane Valley Mall parking lots and rooftops. It's an example of private-public partnerships to install best management practices to protect our surface and groundwater. Any parking lot will have little greasy spots where thousands of cars park, many or even just a few leaving behind a drop or two of oil or transmission fluid, brake and tire wear dust, and discarded food and drinks. Recent development codes in many towns require setting aside some land, usually about one twelfth of the paved over surfaces, to allow rainwater to slowly filter into the soil. This filtration effectively removes pollutants before the water reaches the aquifer and also allows water to gradually flow to streams in a more natural pattern. The Spokane Rathdrum Aquifer is our sole source of drinking water in parts of North Idaho and Eastern Washington. In this case, here in Spokane Valley, and in all of the best partnerships between public and private entities, even larger areas than that 1 12th are set aside as a combination recreational green space and stormwater filtration area. The end result is cleaner water and a park-like area for everyone to enjoy. The next time you visit Spokane Valley Mall, take a little time to explore the green space before you leave. Thanks for watching and thanks for these organizations for supporting this short video.